Hi there, uh, this is example number six, uh, writing numbers in scientific notation but using significant figures. So scientific notation, we have to have um, a number at the beginning between one and 10, but it can't be 10. So basically you have to have one digit followed by a decimal point and then you might have some other digits, okay? Um, then you multiply that by 10 raised to the power of um, a positive or a negative number depending on how many places you've moved the decimal point. So if I'm using this example, um, 5.203 times 10 to the power of 3, the decimal point is moving three places. But the way I've been teaching you for larger numbers where you've got a positive power, you just add one to that number and that's how many digits you've got. So with this larger number over here, um, we can see that there are seven digits um, or that the decimal point must have moved three, six places to get down to, um, to get back between the two and the one. So in scientific notation without significant figures, this is 2.183 times by 10 to the power of six because the decimal point will have moved six places to get from here, where it was originally, to the 2.1. To change it into, sign, into significant figures, we need to set, um, just use three significant figures. So what we want is the first non-zero digit is the two, and we want the one and the eight, but we have to check whether the three actually rounds the eight. Now, um, 83 is closer to 80 than it is to 90, so the eight is going to stay the same. So we have 2.18 times by 10 to the power of 6, and that's our answer. There's your three significant figures, and that's your scientific notation. With smaller numbers, if we had 1.24 times by 10 to the power of negative 5, um, the 5 tells us that the decimal point has moved 5 places, but because it's a negative, the decimal point has moved this, this direction. Um, and what I've been teaching you is that the 5 there is the number of zeros that end up at the beginning of the number. So this one actually ends up being 0 0.0000124, okay? Where there are five zeros at the front or the decimal point has moved five places. So with this one, we can see there are three zeros at the front and that the decimal point has moved three places. So we have one point 9482 times by 10 to the power of negative 3. So that's without the significant figures. With the significant figures though, again, we want the first three non-zero digits, so that one, that one, and that one, but we have to look at this and see if it affects the 4. 48 is closer to 50 than it is to 40. So our number here will become 1.95 times by 10 to the power of negative 3. Three significant figures in scientific notation.